Sebastian Klaun. I'm a professor for composition at uh, Seoul Day. I'm teaching here for four years now and I'm coming from Germany. Yeah, the title of the performance is uh, Violin Space and the reason we call, call it like this is uh, we're, we're doing the performance here in the old power plant of the SNU. And this is a very big place. It's uh, actually very beautiful. It's uh, like an old industrial plant. It has a lot of echo. Maybe you can even hear that now in the interview that there's a lot of uh, sound here. And we place the violins around the audience and uh, we try to let the audience hear how the sound of the violins moves in space. So that's why it's called Violin Space. Uh, the class is about how to program uh, contemporary music in a way that is really exciting for the audience. Performers play either classical music or contemporary music. Usually it's not played together. What we want to show is that if you play together, if you mix uh, contemporary music and classical music, it's much more interesting for the audience, for the performers, for everybody involved. And it's, it can be, be really a very exciting concert. It shows new light on the classical music and it also shows uh, new insights to the contemporary music. So I think it's uh, really beneficial for everybody. Yeah, in this performance, I think it's very special that we do not do any pauses or breaks between the pieces, but the, the whole performance, the whole concert will be played like one, one very long piece. So there will be no applause between the pieces. Also in the program notes, we don't give the sequence of the pieces. So uh, the audience knows which pieces will be played, but they don't know at which time. So in a way, they have to be really open to what happens. It's, it's a little bit like a theatrical performance or like a film. So you really have to be very attentive what happens. And this is like, like one flow from the beginning of the performance to the, to the very end. So this is, I think, quite special for, for this evening. All the repertoire is written for the solo violin, but the pieces are extremely different. Like they, they could not be more different. There's some very consonant music. There's some very dissonant music. There's some noise. There's some very peaceful sounds. There's some very loud pieces. There are some very soft pieces. And what we want to show is the different aspects of the solo violin. So just, it's just one, one small instrument, but it can do so many different things, so many different music, so many different sounds. And uh, to see like we have six performers, they are placed around the audience, they will play very different pieces. And I think it will be very, very interesting to follow this performance and to see how very different pieces from very different uh, periods really can form a whole. They, they really work together and give a, a new image of a whole performance. Uh, I hope that uh, during the performance the audience is really surprised, that they, they really are astonished because the concert is different than they expected. So even the, the way the uh, performers come on stage or they go off stage will be a little bit different than from normal concerts. All the uh, way the, the, the pieces are following each other will be quite different from, from other concerts. So I think it will be quite astonishing for almost everybody in the audience. This is uh, what I want to, the, uh, the audience to experience during the concert. So they should be really very, very attentive. Oh, what's happening here? And after the concerts, it would be great if they see that or if they understand that contemporary music, but any, any kind of music can be really exciting and really um, can be seen in a new way if you uh, present it in the right way, if you present it in a fresh way, where it's not like the normal concert. This, I think, uh, would be great if the uh, audience brings that back home and is maybe expecting something similar uh, the next time too.